Alrighty, Steve. <clears throat> Just wanted to show you here. This is called DAP Download Accelerator Plus, and it's only been like two minutes in here. About I've been off the phone with you, and here it is. I'm already at 253 megabytes downloaded, with 10 minutes remaining at a speed of 671 kilobytes. The big trick about this program is, is it finds the fastest servers and breaks it up into one file, but it breaks it up. So here it could be it could be eight or ten, I think. I got it set at five because usually that's pretty much enough for most servers. And this is what I'm going to be sending you eventually. Um, we'll not put all the birds or not put all the whatever. We're not putting all the accounting all the eggs ahead of time. But this is one of the programs yeah, you definitely want, as you can tell, because you were going to be over an hour, right? And here I am looking at basically under 10 minutes for a whole CD of information. So here is 55 seconds. And what's good about this here, <clears throat> I can keep switching sites by hitting this and going down a list if I find faster servers and unlike anything else I can pause this and I can resume which means see where it says resume supported which means anything can happen okay I could take this thing the computer could stop today and then even a year later or even next year year after that I could come back and res and uh, open this up and I'll see a bunch of files it's not here I can't show you but it shows me every file I've started or finished I click on it and it will as it says resume and start downloading right from where it started with no damage uh, to the file whatsoever and that's what's so awesome about this and another thing about this it doesn't matter where I got the file from I can resume from another place so if this website all of a sudden decide ah, you're not getting it no more I find it somewhere else DAP will find out it's the same program and resume downloading it alrighty I wanted to show you that about DAP and that's how I get my downloads done very fast alrighty man you take care bye All right, I was talking about before about the file list here. Well, here's the file list, all right? It shows the percentage of completed, and this is part of the resume list. And here you can see Adobe Photoshop is at 0%, and since the link's not good, but I can click on it if I want it to, and I can choose delete, or I can resume, or I can find if I know of an assholes with fucking phones. And if I know of another um, URL that it's at, I collect, collect, click Add URL. Now, when you get the program, you need to configure this, all right? So I'm going to close this part down. And what you're going to do is you're going to go over here to where it says File. Come on, stop fucking doing this to me. It's my recorder that's causing this problem. All right. Correction again. Go to Downloads, Options and Configurations. General. Leave it alone. Save to. Go over here to Browse and select any folder you want all your downloads to go into. Connection, I recommend for DSL and cable and all that, keep it at 512. And acceleration mode, acceleration speed. As far as everything else goes, like advanced and all that other shit, pretty much leave it alone. Okay? And just go down here to close. And you're done. So now, you'll see the icon I can't show you, but down in the um, tray down here where the clock is, you'll find it. It has a lightning bolt on it. You will click on it and say, okay, I need to download this. So go add new URL and paste it in here. And hit OK. And then it'll show you a bunch of, um, what the hell they call those? Mirrors, where they're at. And then you wait till it loads. Then you hit OK and your download starts. And it'll be extremely fast. So that concludes how fast it is, how to configure it, and where your files will be. And that's it. All right, guys, and anybody else that wants to download it, you're welcome to it, too. You only have to download one of those. I just I just included two places, so just in case one person is not familiar with one site or if something goes wrong, then you have a backup. All right, take care, and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.